A very warm welcome to Shomu's Biology Academy and this is going to be a biotechnology lecture series video for all of you. So what is the law of dominance? The law of dominance states that in a cross of, pure, of parents that are pure for contrasting traits. Contrasting traits means one is, say for example, one is dominant and one is recessive or one is tall and one is dwarf, one is round and one is wrinkled. These are known as contrasting characters. The one trait, only one form of the trait will appear in the next generation. Only one form of the trait, like we used to see in the F1 monohybrid cross, one trait will be present in the F1 generation. All the offsprings will be heterozygous and express only the dominant trait. It will only express the dominant trait. Meaning the pure plant uh, cross between a homozygous dominant and a homozygous recessive will all bear offsprings which are hybridized but all are round seeds. In a dominant, in the there there can be three genotype yields. There can be three genotype yields when we are considering the F2 generation, and when we are considering the F2 generation means the cross is between F1 and F1. Then we are getting F2. Then only we can have three genotype yields. Then we can have the say for example, if this is considered as Y, Y cross between capital Y and small Y, then we are only getting these kinds of traits so 3 is to 1 ratio will be yellow is to green but two of them will be genotypically hybrid and one of them will be homozygous dominant means they will be of pure trait and one of them will be uh, hy not hybrid one of them will be homozygous recessive and they will be green so there can be only two phenotypes and three genotypic yields if you like our video, please hit the like button, share this video with your friends and colleagues and please don't forget to subscribe to this channel so that you get more and more of this kind of video in future. Thank you.